Hey friends, it's Robert. Join me today as we visit the Netherlands to celebrate the winter holiday of St. Nicholas Day. On St. Nicholas Eve, Dutch children fill a shoe with carrots for Sinterklaas's horse and set it by the fireplace or radiator. He in turn fills the shoe with treats while they sleep. I can think of no better DIY than to customize a shoe for the occasion, but not just any shoe. We'll begin by giving our wooden shoe a light sanding with a fine grit sandpaper, and then wipe it down with a clean cloth. A customary sweet left by Sinterklaas is a piece of chocolate in the shape of the recipient's first initial. Now in keeping with this tradition, I want to show you a clever way to monogram your wooden shoe in an unexpected way, with a customized temporary tattoo. You can find temporary tattoo paper at your local craft store or purchase it online like I did. I found it available for both laser and inkjet printers. Follow the manufacturer's instructions, pick your favorite font, size it to fit properly on your shoe, print your initial and apply the adhesive sheet. Do make certain to reverse the orientation of the letter so that it reads correctly on your shoe. You can see that I've added little decorative clip art on either side of my initial. You can customize your monogram in any way you'd like. Now carefully cut around your temporary tattoo, trimming it close to the design. Peel away the adhesive sheet and position the tattoo on your wooden shoe printed side down. Apply a clean wet cloth to the back side of the tattoo and hold until the paper is saturated and easily slips off. You'll see that your monogram has beautifully and easily transferred onto the shoe. Allow the wood around the tattoo to completely dry and to ensure the design doesn't rub off, we're going to seal it with a clear varnish. Brush a coat over the entire exterior of the shoe and allow it to dry. For extra protection, you can always add a second or a third coat. Once the varnish is completely dry, your customized wooden shoe is ready to fill with holiday goodies. But even after St. Nicholas Day is passed, it has an extended life as a unique piece of home decor. Tuck it into a bookcase, feature it on a coffee table, or even allow it to serve as a temporary home to a potted plant. Now I have to tell you that I grew up in Western Michigan where there is a sizable Dutch community, and we lived not far from the city of Holland, Michigan which, complete with windmills, held an annual tulip festival, and every elementary school child took a field trip to the wooden shoe factory. So you can probably imagine my excitement at being able to order an actual pair of wooden shoes for this project. But I fully recognize that this may not be a feasible purchase for everyone, so I want to show you a companion project with easily accessible materials. Using a simple wooden box from my craft store, I applied multiple ready-made temporary tattoos to the exterior. I then sealed the wood with a coat of clear varnish in the exact same way we finished the wooden shoe. And for an added pop of color, I painted the interior red. This makes the perfect holiday gift box to fill with sweets for your favorite someone. Or if your favorite someone loves a simple DIY, you can stock the box with all of the necessary supplies. Paint, varnish, brushes, and temporary tattoos Include a link to this video in their card and they'll have a step-by-step -step tutorial to complete the project on their own. Thank you so much for watching, and if you haven't done so already, let me encourage you to subscribe to Kin Community and join me next time for another world-inspired DIY.